Americans paused today to remember and celebrate the life of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Many participated in a day of service. This year marks 60 years since the March on Washington and Dr. King's speech demanding civil rights, jobs, and freedom. We will be remembering Dr. King throughout our newscast this afternoon and evening. Earlier this morning, the annual Dr. Martin Luther King Parade was held in downtown Las Vegas. Candace Charles was there. Well, it's been an exciting day here in downtown Las Vegas as people come together, really from all over, to enjoy, to honor, and to celebrate the legacy of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. We've seen a little bit of everyone from state officials like Susie and Lee. We've seen a couple of dance teams. As you can see, we see one right now coming on down and enjoying. We've seen, of course, some black engineers showing off some of their robotics work. Uh, Wendell P. Williams, who founded Las Vegas' Martin Luther King Day Parade, says that there were more than 100 entries involved in the parade. There was definitely a little bit of something for everyone. We spoke to a couple of people out here who said they were just happy to see the community come together in such a beautiful and wonderful way. One of the things that honors Martin Luther King Jr.'s speech, I have a dream. And of course, we got to speak with someone who was actually from Morehouse, Dr. Dr. Martin Luther King Jr.'s alma mater. He says he went to school with two of King's kids and really felt his presence here today. It's a very special day. It's a day of remembrance and consideration for all of the sacrifices that he made to build community. We've also heard from all over the world, a lot of people came out to enjoy and celebrate Again, the wonderful legacy of Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. From downtown Las Vegas at 4th and Gas, where the Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. parade started. I'm Candace Charles. News now.